Hey friends, my name is Caitlin and welcome back to my channel. If you like all things travel, lifestyle, and home decor, then you're in the right place. Hit the subscribe button below so you won't miss a video. Other than that, welcome to my fall home decor 2021 haul. <laughs> if you like all things fall home decor, you're in the right place and keep watching for inspiration. Alright, so first things first, I went shopping at Hobby Lobby and our local thrift store here in the Ohio area. Um, and I just really love fall because it brings like this sense of coziness to the home. And um, that's kind of what I'm trying to create. So a lot of the decor you're going to be seeing is a more neutral theme. There is some reds and oranges in there, but not much. The first thing that I picked out were these picks. Again, I actually got these earlier in the summertime um, because I had a bridal shower for a friend that I was decorating and so I got these and they were 40% off and a lot of the core is still 40% off so get it but um, these are more of a muted yellow with some muted green leaves as well and I thought they were really pretty because they're not like the overpowering fall colors like the bright oranges and the reds but they're a little more muted but they look more aged and so I really liked these because you could put them probably in like a wreath or a floor arrangement or just add them to like a mantle place and it would look really pretty and cozy. The next thing I got with those the same time earlier this summer were these white um, berries I think is kind of what they are. They're supposed to look like berries. <laughs> And I really liked these too because they were really simple and white and they can go really with anything, any time of year. Um, but they were also 40% off, so they were only probably like about $1.50 a piece, I think. Um, but they're really pretty and I thought they would go well with um, a floor arrangement. The next thing I got, I searched all over the store for it because I saw someone else post about these on Instagram and I loved the color. Um, so it's these, I think they're called like baked cinnamon lagerus whatever that is it's like a kind of like a furry type of plant but um, I love this really deep muted cinnamon color um, I thought it would go really well with a lot of the other muted colors that I have so I'll probably put this in a vase and maybe layer it on top of my TV stand which is like my mantle place um, so I'm really excited to decorate these because I just love this color and the next thing that I've got were these really pretty placemats. I've been looking for placemats that were a little bit more brown or neutral color and I love that Hobby Lobby had these because they're they're really simple and textured but they um, bring a lot of diversity to my table. My table is really just brown and then I have a lot of white things on it and so it would just be nice to have something else that's a little bit different to kind of give it a little bit of diversity to my tabletop. So I'm excited to use these and see how they look on my table. But these were originally $10 and I got them 40% off. So it was about like seven, six, seven dollars So the next thing that I got were these picks as well. These were about $2.99 a piece. So they were 40% off, so about a dollar, dollar and a half. And I loved this one, if you can see that. This really pretty like feathery type of pick that I thought would be really pretty in like a little tiny candle holder or something like that and just like to put in like a wreath or an arrangement just to kind of give a little bit of contrast to the bright colors um, or muted colors that I have I thought was super pretty and I have another one of those like cottontail type of pieces this one's fake though and it's white because I love white <laughs> and I thought the color was really pretty. It's like a yellowish white. Um, but again, I just wanted something to add to like an arrangement or another piece. And those again were 40% off as well. Um, and then I got these that are just like little pieces of cotton. Usually they come in like a stem, but I liked they were separate from the stem because I got, you'll see soon, like another piece to put on my um, dining room table that I thought would look really cute inside that little bowl type thing that I got. And these were originally $4.99, but I got them for the off, so they were a pretty good deal. And the next thing that I got was this dough bowl. And I've been looking for one of these for a good price for longer than I'd like to admit, <laughs> but I really loved it. I thought I loved the texture of it. Um, and I thought it'd be really pretty on my tabletop again to put some of those pieces in and maybe some candles and things like that. But I love this piece. It was originally, I think, $24.99, I think, and I got that 40% off. So it was a pretty good deal. 
from the other ones I was looking at were bigger and more expensive. So check it out. <laughs> All right, the next thing that I got were these little white pumpkins. And I have some pumpkins, or some are gray, some are off-white, and so I thought it'd be fun to get a little bit more to decorate with to put it in jars or um, again on my TV stand because I have a little nook you can put things in. I thought, be, I thought that would be pretty as well. Um, but you can do a lot of different things with these, which is why I love them. They're white and so they'll go with really any color scheme you have. Even if white isn't in your color scheme, they'll still look well because it's a neutral color, or it will still go well because it's a neutral color. Uh, and so I really like these for that reason. You can just, you can do a lot of different things with them, so. Oh, I really love these. So I got one of these beaded garlands, which, you know, have been in style recently. Um, but I really loved it, this because it was more of like a neutral, natural beaded color. And, um, I didn't know exactly where I wanted to put this. I'm thinking it's probably gonna go on my TV stand or maybe my dining room table. But I really like this because it's natural and so it's gonna go with all the colors that I picked out. So this was originally $8.99 and I got it 40% off, which is a great deal for something like that. It's so long. Oh, and the pumpkins were $10 and I got them 40% off. The next thing I got was a kitchen towel. It just says grateful. And it was $5.99 originally and I was 40% off. And I just like this because I really like decorating in my kitchen with kitchen towels that have cute things on them or different colors to put on my oven. Um, so I just think it's really cute. Oh, and this was, like I said, $5.99. I got it 40% off, so. I'm really excited about these. <laughs> um, I love, let me, let me just proclaim this. You'll see this in future videos, I'm sure. I love colored glass. And so when amber bottles came in style, I was super excited. Um, I just think the colors of these, you can kind of see in the light behind me, are super pretty. Um, and it goes really well with fall decor just because a lot of the colors are those oranges and reds and yellows and brown always goes really well with those. Um, my home is, especially downstairs, which is where a lot of these will be used, is like a gray or off-white. And so the brown's gonna look super pretty with that, especially with different fall florals inside of them. And I got um, two of these. One's a bigger size that was $12.99, and that was 40% off. And this one was $5.99, and that was 40% off. And so I really couldn't beat that deal. And look how pretty this glass is. I just kind of... Oh, my next item is this cute little house that I got. And what I loved about this is it was really similar to the Christmas line last year. If you guys saw those, they had these little ceramic houses that you could build a little village in. And I love that it lights up. Let me see if I can. There it is. <laughs> um, I just thought it'd be really cute. I might get a few more for Christmas decor but um, just to kind of break up the pumpkins <laughs> in the, uh, the decor that I'm gonna have, I'll probably put this on my TV stand again. Um, so we'll see what I end up doing with it, but I thought it was super cute and super cozy looking. So, and this was originally $4.99 and it was 40% off. All right, and I think that's all of the pieces from um, Hobby Lobby. So now I'm gonna show you what I got from my thrift store. And again, these are just really unique pieces. And so if you have a local thrift store or antique shop, which is Mine was kind of a combination of both. They had some really cheap items that were just old and had a lot of antique pieces as well. I suggest you check that out if you love home decor because you can get some really cool pieces for really cheap. Um, and cheap is always up my alley because I'm a bargain shopper. And the pieces I got, again, more brown glass. It's this old, kind of like milk water bottle, whatever you want to call it, but it has this topper that goes inside of it as well. I thought was weird, but this was only eight dollars, um, which I thought was a great deal for something this big. And I could do like a simple floral in it or um, anything, or just leave it on its own. I have these two built-in hutches in our dining room that I'm trying to figure out what the heck to do with, so it might end up in there. Ooh. All right, this one was big. This one is like kind of like a just a little jar mug type thing. Oh. 
I really liked this because again I have these big hutches I don't know what to do with in my home and I'm excited I got some pieces that I thought would look really pretty in there and this is one of them I really love old ceramic pieces this was only I think it I don't have a tag on it but I think it was um, only eight dollars as well which is a cheap for something this massive and it came with a lid too which i thought was fun all right and the next piece is actually this bucket itself um but it's basically just an old ice cream maker and i love that it still had these gold plated iron pieces on it and the wood itself i thought was still in really great condition and so, and so i'm really excited about this because i thought it was so pretty um, but it still had a lot of the pieces still intact in it. So again, and this was only $15 for something this massive, um, which I thought was a great deal because that like Hobby Lobby or something like that would probably be in the 30s, 40s, 50s. And so it's another ceramic piece. Um, ironically, a lot of these pieces weren't even together, but they all matched really well. So again, it has that brown painted ceramic piece. Um, I thought it was super. Uh, I thought this was really pretty, and I love that it matched a lot of the other pieces that I got. So, this was only I think five dollars, or maybe it was three, between <laughs> something like that. Oh yeah, I love this one. Okay, this is another little picture. It's like a bluish grayish color, and I really loved it because it was in such great quality. Uh, but it's porcelain, but it was made in China, and I love this blue or like dark gray muted color. It goes really well with our um, dining room, so this will probably end up in our hutch as well. But I thought it was such a cute little piece, and it has some knobbing on this side and on the rim as well. So I thought that was super cute. But yeah, this I know was only $3, which is why I picked it up. <laughs> All right, this is a brown glass piece. If you can see, it's just an old bottle with the cork still in it and everything like that. And what I really love about pieces like this is that it gives a little bit more character to it because it's, um, it's an older piece and this was only $2. So I really can't beat that. <laughs> um, but I loved that color and I thought this would be pretty with some florals or just on its own. And so we'll see what we do with it. But All right. This piece is also another amber glass piece. Um, this one was three dollars, and but um, I really liked this for a little bit of a floral arrangement. Probably gonna go on my dining room table with some stuff in it to layer other things. And that was my last piece that I found, but I thought that color and the, the ribbing was really pretty to contrast the plain glass look that I have going on in my home currently. So that is it. <laughs> All right, well that concludes my fall home decor shop with me. So thank you for coming and hanging out with me for what was a really short but fun video and I hope you enjoyed all the things that I found. Um, like I said, I'll probably do a um, clean and decorate with me for the fall so you guys can see all the things that I have already as well as how I style them. So if that is something that you like to watch or um, would enjoy, please hit the subscribe button so you can see more of that. But also, um, just thank you for watching. And if you like this video, hit the thumbs up so I know this is the type of content that you guys enjoy. Um, but other than that, thanks for hanging out with me, and I hope you have a great day.